go. <sighs> Fuck me, dude. <clears throat> Jesus. <laughs> Three, seven, six, eight. All right, let's see here. So it's number 24. I want to say it's easier than these two. Harder than Elite Z Rebirth. And like anything below it. Man, these are so close in difficulty. <clears throat> I haven't beaten this yet, so it's not a reliable opinion. But, um... Yeah, I'm gonna go with slightly easier than Arcane 16. No, that's without the swag route. With the swag route, this shit's like right here. <laughs> the swag routes. The swag route might be harder than Colorful Corruption. It's around there. <clears throat> I died to the swag route like 20 fucking times from zero. Well, let's talk about this level though. <clears throat> Let me just say something. This plain UFO part... That part that we just watched is one of the worst parts I have ever seen in a level of all time. This part is so fucking bad that I wouldn't even- I wouldn't recommend it. I wouldn't even- I wouldn't recommend this level. The rest of the level's are like an 8.5, maybe a 9. This shit's a negative 10. This part right here. This shit part right here. By the way, whoever the creator was, I don't, I don't know who the fuck it is. I don't really care, to be honest. Never do this shit again. Never do that again. Without this, it's a great level. So you have to add some bullshit. Now, how much of my anger accounted for getting past this part and then dying at the swag route 20 times from zero. I should have beaten the level in 2,000 attempts. Though, I don't know, I don't know. If you don't go for the swag route, this part would only make your enjoyment go down from like a nine to an eight out of 10, realistically. A lot of my anger from this part came from having to play through it so many times. And then I died past here like three times, I think. I'll, f I'll find the, the specific deaths. I'll, 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 I don't know where they are. <clears throat> but yeah.